Hey guys, it's Wolf with Valhalla Gaming, and we are back with Timberborn. And as you can see, we're on something new because uh, they updated the game, and that update crashed my last save. But before we start, I'm gonna need y'all to click that like button, hit that subscribe, and ring the bell. So we don't have that anymore. Yeah, I'm kinda sad about it. So we're going for terraces. And we're going to be using the Iron Teeth, which sound like a dwarf name, but uh, in honor of our beavers who have unceremoniously ended their save, we are going to be naming our district after the Harfoot Clan, as requested from last episode of Season 1, the Harfoots. We can just call these the descendants of those. Long time has passed, you know, these guys came about. And as you can see, we're on a new map. This is terraces. Uh, it's going to provide a bit more of a challenge when it comes to water. I think our only water sources come from... Oh god, this is really far down here. I think the only water sources in map come from right here, which is next to me. There may be some over here somewhere that are just dried out. Yeah, I don't think so. I think the only water sources in the entire map... Wait, maybe? Okay, so we have five water sources and then two that are pouring right here, I think. Okay. So the first thing we're going to do is build a dam, clearly. Because we're beavers and that's what we do. So we're going to dam that so we can do this. And I'm doing that almost immediately for multiple reasons. We are on hard mode, which means the droughts can go anywhere from a week. I think they start off at like five days, which is already pretty up there for a brand new thing. So they can go anywhere from a week to uh, 30 days. So a 30 day drought. I do not know if I can do a 30 day drought. I have never tried. So we're going to try. So the first thing we're going to do is get our lumberjack flag going here. We're going to cut down some trees. We're going to immediately start getting water and food ready. So we're also going to start working on a farmhouse. And all the water, or all the area that's green right here is what I want to be able to plant. So as long as I can plant all of that area right there, I will be happy. We will path to you. Okay, so this half is going to be crops. This half is going to be chopping down trees. We're going to set that up right now. Right here, all the way down to here, and all of this. Because, yes. Uh, eventually we will do something else for that. Over here we will have a gatherer flag, we'll have a farm, and we'll have that. And then for you, we're going to start planting carrots pretty much immediately. Let me get crops. We're going to start planting carrots pretty much immediately. We're also going to get a path that comes down and around right here. So the carrots will go right here because we're also going to need our water pumps. Now, the good thing about these beavers is they have a deep water water pump. So I can pump from six blocks down. So if I do turn this into a reservoir later on for the longer droughts, we can have a six block deep reservoir. There we go. We have a carrot patch already planted. or We have everything. Okay, now we just need to let them go about their... Okay, and we speed up time. So now they're going to start building. They'll start gathering. Uh, they'll start bringing things over here. Uh, the farmhouse is going to be my number one priority. It's 25 logs. So as it gets made, I'll take one of my workers from over here and put him in there. Because I have seven beavers and we already have six jobs. So these beavers don't reproduce with a... Uh, can't English right now. 
They don't reproduce with just having... They don't reproduce the normal way. Uh, you have to have these breeding pods. These breeding pods create new beavers. So I'll start with one for now, just so we can start having new beavers. Uh, that's almost done. That's about 50% done. For now, we'll do another lumberjack flag, just to help with that one extra beaver. Once, uh, once everything gets built. You, why aren't you gathering things? Okay, so he's maxed out on berries. They updated the storage, and I'm not sure how this works. Um, they have industrial piles, warehouses, and tanks now. Warehouses just look like that. Uh, medium warehouses look like that. Okay. Oh, we need water. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, high priority. Come on, 11. He needs one more log. Oh, don't drown. Don't, don't. I forget they don't come with any water. Oh, we need water first. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. There's two logs here. Okay. Um, high pry, high pry. Can I get a log over here, please? And then get some water, please. Thank you. You're going to be the savior. Oh, no, I need a builder. Okay, now somebody can go in here and start pumping water. And we will get rid of two of you. That way we have full manpower on these. So now we have food planted. We have water coming. We have trees being chopped down. We have everything we need currently, except storage of food. So next is going to be food storage. Oh, I need to build a pathway over there, don't I? They're not even going to start looking at that until there's a pathway that'll go to it. Now they'll start building it. Okay, so we have that going. We have food planted. We have other food. Uh, he needs berries and water to start giving me children. That's fine. We're gonna need water storage, first of all. So let's do some storage. We're gonna do... Um, we'll do a medium warehouse right here. I want food storage. We're going to do food storage right here, actually. Do I want it, like, right here and then right here? We'll do it right there in front of the berries for now. That's fine. Uh, they're going to build this first, which is a priority for me because we really need this water. Like, y'all don't understand how quickly hard mode can go bad. We need that, and then we're going to need a power. Do we still have large water wheel, power wheel... Okay, so we need a backup. So the power wheel is our backup source of energy, so we're going to do that. So this is something early game that we're going to do. We're going to have a power wheel. And it's going to connect, and then we will put our plank factory. Our lumber mill right next to it. We're also going to need science, which is going to be an inventor's hut. Which is going to go right there. Oh, that looks different. It's a wind turbine on top of the inventor's hut. That's cool. Uh, this means that I will need one, two, three more beavers, and I only have one. Not ideal. Not ideal at all, Jeremiah. But we'll get there. We'll get there. Look, we're already starting to get this going, which means I could build water wheels. Uh, it, it just auto-saved. I don't like that power. Uh, compact water wheels only take 25 logs. These take... F Wait, a power wheel takes 40 logs? Oh, never mind, never mind, never mind. We'll do a compact water wheel. Right here. Because we can do a compact water wheel right there. And then we can just throw our... Lumber mill. Right there. Then we'll just path around it. Like that. Okay. There we go. Okay. Okay. Now we have two beavers without jobs. Perfect. We're starting to get a few beavers. We've got food coming in. Um, we need research. So we have two. We need one and two. We need these two things built. We need this built. Um... 
for goods. This one can only accept berries, I guess. And then I'll have to build another one for carrots, which is fine. Because these only build two at a time. Or can only accept... They only accept one item at a time. I can't say I like that. But it'll make your storage a little bit more interesting. We do have the drought coming in three days. Now, I know last time I asked, I was like, do y'all want me to cut out the drought or the wet season? With the drought being a potential of up to 30 days, do you still want the wet season? Like, is that something we still want? Uh, I want this carrot storage area built. Berries are going to go there. Carrots are going to go here as it's built. And if that's something that y'all do still want, is the dry season to be cut out. The videos are going to become much, much shorter. I just want that to be prefaced before we do anything further. I am going to do this video and just kind of see what happens. Oh, we have an inventor, so now we have science. Uh, how much research do we have right now? Seven. I need 60 for the forester. We need a forester. Once we have a forester, we'll be good. We'll be set. We can start doing things. Taking our time a little bit. Um... We have a little bit of a reservoir here, not much. It should last our beavers, whatever the first drought cycle is going to be. Uh, they're building our two things over here. And then we can build a backup power supply if we need to. That makes sense to me. I have 40 ounces of coffee and I'm ready to take on the hardest mode of this game and see what happens. I'm very curious. I'm still minorly upset that I logged on today to record about my other beavers and this is what happened, but, uh, uh, yeah, this is what happened. So, we're gonna live with it. It's not the first time we've had to unceremoniously end a season, and it will not be the last. What was that? Oh, my phone. My phone did that weird static interference that it does. Oh, we have carrots coming in now. Oh, thank God. So we have 30 carrots, 41 berries. I do like that. You can... Uh, they have berry... Oh, I, can I stop clipping? Thank you. They have berries, like actual, like just boxes of blueberries. That's kind of cool. Uh, we have two beavers without a job. One of them will be here soon, making planks. The other one will soon be a forester, once I have enough research. Um, speaking of which, escaping structure, uh, wood, here it is. Oh no, I want research. We're going to build another inventor hut, just for now. One, okay, the drought is starting. Let's see how long the drought is. Zero days until the drought starts. Let's see how long the drought's going to be. So we're going to pause him because it automatically does not matter. We're going to cut our working hours back to 15, 14 a day. Drought ended. Wet season started. So let's see. Let's kick back our working hours back to 16. We can start pumping water continuously now. Because we're about to start flowing over. We have 12 beavers. We're going to need... How much science do we have? We're going to need platforms pretty soon. We're going to have to start going downstairs. Like down towards these areas. And collecting from down there somehow. I'm just trying to figure out where would be suitable... If I dam it up over there, it's just going to overflow over there. However, if I did like a mega dam from like here to here, that would block a lot of water into this reservoir back here. Ooh. Or I could start small and just flood right here to start. But 
we have to see if we can even reach there first. So we're going to need paths. We're going to need stairs. We're going to need platforms. Okay. We're going to need all that. We're going to need this to get unpaused so we can start building this. And then we will redo our blueberries to where they're more densely packed, I suppose. And we will redo all of the trees. Okay. We're getting somewhere. <clears throat> Everything appears being demolished. Perfect. They're clearing out the areas up there, which is what I wanted. This area down here is coming along nicely. Did I get dams yet? I forgot. I did not need 120 for dams. Okay, that's fine. One baby beaver. I still have two worker. Uh, yeah, I don't need two of them. about this one? 18 and 18. Okay. That's almost built. Needs one more plank. And then I'm going to delete his building. Oh, we also get resources back. I forget that whenever you knock down a building. Okay, so hold on. Now that we have our person here, um, yeah, we're just going to go plant trees. We're going to start with birch just because they're the fastest growing. And I want one, two, three lines of birch. What's one, two, three... Four, five, six, seventy nine. Quick maths. I can't math. I don't know. What's one, two, three, four, five? I I lost count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen times three. Twenty eight. Thirty eight. Forty two. Forty two. Sure. I don't know. That's math. I can't math. We're just nah. nah fast forward anyway. And we'll do that. And we're going to mark the rest of these trees for demo. And we're going to start planting... Three days until the next drought. Okay. Not ideal, not ideal, not ideal. <clears throat> that was a very short lived wet season which is why i asked if y'all want the wet seasons now or the dry seasons because in hard mode it's going to be it's going to be rough not going to lie it's going to be rough we're going to plant three rows of pine and i think maple is the most efficient 30 days for eight nine days for one pine I'm gonna do like 40 whatever of each. And then the rest of that'll get knocked down and we'll just fill it in as we go. But for now, that'll do. Actually, we'll just do four rows of birch. We'll do four rows and then we'll do four rows of maple. And then as the rest of these get chopped down, we'll fill it in. Okay, we have done that. <clears throat> things are... Things are thinging. They're definitely thinging. We're thinging away. Okay. Now we can build pretty much straight down. So if I were to extend... A dam... over here I want to just come straight back and I wanted to dam this up to like okay we're gonna do some stuff here real quick if I were to not dam I need not enough science points how much for a dam 120 we are almost there okay I can go up one two three. Three blocks. So if I dam this up by three blocks, 
and then walk down here, I could have a decently large reservoir over here that we're going to start working on. So we're going to, now that I have paths, because I can kind of just jimmy my way around things, I suppose. Or I could just come down this way. Hmm. I don't like this at all. <clears throat> We're gonna need a way down anyway, so we might as well just... I gotta go up three. Oh, I have enough for my... Hold on, let me... So if I were to do this, and I were to go... One... Two, and then... Three. With that... Third one, okay. So that would be fine. We have, okay, let's see what the dry season's gonna be. Four days, okay, so not bad, not bad yet. Okay, and the dry season has ended. Drought ended, wet season beginning. So now we should have, we're getting close to the end of our little red line over here. Probably would have been definitely not as resource intensive if I did a different one. Oh, yeah, I don't need you. These are both summer only. Or, these are both uh, dry season only. But now we have trees, we have all these trees being planted and being built. He's finishing up planting, we're getting rid of some more... Things are coming along. Chestnut, maple. There we go. There we go. Okay. And we're almost done over here completely. Now we just need to get that built, which it looks like it's almost done. It needs two more planks, which is fine. Um... The log pile looks good. We don't have many planks, but that's because we just got them. Okay. We are doing okay. We are surviving. The Harfoots will survive. We are... This is going to be the Shire. We're making the Shire. I don't remember the Shire being built on a plateau. I think the Ring Wraiths would have had a lot harder of a time to get there. This is what you get for suggesting I name them after Hobbits, though. Love coffee in the morning. Nope, there. Okay, so they have started official work on the. I'm not gonna call this a mega dam, but it's definitely. Ooh, if that backfills, oh, that's gonna backfill all of this too, because of the height. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Let me. No, not that. Yeah, that's going to backfill all of this into this, too. So we may have set ourselves up here for a great success. I don't want to get rid of the blueberries just yet, but what if we did it in, like, little segments? If we got rid of the blueberries in little segments and started planting them. What's the edge of his... Alright, so for this, we're just going to get rid of anything that's not in his limit. So we're going to... We're going to demolish this last little row. So Right there. We'll demolish those. And then we're also going to demolish these. And these are going to be the ones that we plant back. All of those are going to be planted ones. Oh boy. Oh, they built the first one already. They're already going to work on the second one. Oh, this is exciting. Oh, this is exciting. I'm excited. Can't you tell? Uh, 
one too many beaver or not enough beavers so we need more beavers so i'm gonna build a second breeding pod my poor beavers are still also just living out in the open but currently uh survival over comfort so they will be okay why are you not cut down yet come on thank you i like how as i said it he cut it down <laughs> Put our last maple tree down here. And that should be everything. Okay. We are already starting to harvest birch. <laughs> we have a maple tree planted over here. Oh no. Okay, so we have three days until the next drought. Um, slow down some more. We'll just finish this row out with maples and then we'll finish this row out with pine that way it at least goes all the way to the edge and it looks decent we're also going to demolish this one just because it kind of looks annoying okay oh they've built the second one i don't think we're going to have this done in time for this wet season or this drought um but we will have it done hopefully in time for the next wet season or drought not sure. The dams are going to be the expensive parts. They take 20 logs a piece. Uh, we only have one log right now. <laughs> not a whole lot. Not not a whole lot. There is some pretty easily accessible metal. Metal, metal, metal everywhere. So I can get behind that. Um, over here, we're already on this level. So I don't see any reason why we couldn't come dam down here too if I were to just path over to it or do I just want to build a staircase down I just want a staircase down right here right here path to it path here path here don't even need that one. We'll build two more dams down here. Three more, sorry. If we can even build that many. I don't know. We should be able to. If we can reach all the way over there, we should be able to reach there. That's fine. We can always move our district around if we need to. Uh, so they have started destroying the blueberries. The blueberries, honestly, for them are really only important for breeding, but we're also maxed out on blueberries right now, so I'm okay with that. Even with the drought approaching, I'm okay with us getting rid of these because we still have all these and all of them are still in bloom and there's literally not enough of a demand for them. We have one baby beaver. Um, that is not the priority currently. Currently, I'm going to put all of these as our priority. Everything right here is going to be a priority for us, at least. Everything's going to work on this. So that's what we're waiting to get built now. Because we really don't need any of this water. We need this water that's flowing right here. After this point, it's already going to the edge of the map. I can't do a lot with that. Unless I were to, like, come over here and dam it up again. Put a levee here. Dam this all the way up. And then it would flow backwards over here. But then it would overflow over here. And off the edge of the map. And that's not what I'm trying to do. Okay, so a drought started. Six days. I don't think that's going to be an issue. I hope it's not going to be an issue. We survived four and five days, um, so we should be okay. I have one job, so we're going to pause one of my inventories for now. Uh, they still haven't gathered all these resources yet, which is fine. All those resources are going to go here towards our dam. Here comes the water. Yes, 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 yes. And we can start. See how nice that is? Because we can reach down there with those. But we're not going to build those right there. Because that wouldn't line up perfectly. 
And we both know how I do that. So we do this. And bloop. And a bloop. And we pass and we go right here and right here. Then we're going to go right here and we're going to go storage. Jesus Christ. So these need gears. So the medium ones still need gears, which is fine. I don't know why you're hungry or thirsty. There's food and water and abundance currently. Oh, they currently... Okay, thank God. So we can... They're two down. They can get to the dam now. Good things are going to start happening now. I know it's too far away from a district center currently. We have two baby beavers. Things are slowly getting better for the beavers, even with these dry seasons that are going to continually get longer and longer and longer. Um, I'm still terrified of what happens if a 30 day dry season happens. This water is not going to be used for food anymore, or for pumping purposes. This reservoir over here will be used for it once these are built. These are no priority. These are all high priority. So we have to build quite a few more before they're ready to go. Um, now I think the happier the beavers are, they need shelter. So the happier they are, the better they work anyway. So we're going to actually start building shelter. So this can hold 10, 16. So we're going to build a barracks. And we're going to build the barracks over here. Build two of them. Uh, yeah, we'll build two. It's going to take 80 logs, Jesus. Actually, no, we're not going to put the barracks down. These beavers are not about comfort comfortable life like the other ones but we will give them a comfortable life so they're going to be up here and they're going to overlook things there we go for now at least that'll work for now imagine how nice it would be though just looking out your window and this is what you see like living on a cliff edge it'd be nice it's quaint so we'll do that Eventually, these will get knocked down. We have three days until the next drought already. So as you can see, the wet season is much shorter. I think that was like, that's four days, so it'll be a seven-day wet season. That's not very long. That's, that's as long as like some of our droughts were last season. So the sooner we get this reservoir built, the better. Because I don't know how long we'll be able to last with just doing what we're doing. Um, we do have 16 logs. We have enough science for now, so if I pause you and give you another... We're just not going to worry about the science. I'm going to worry about building. So we're going to build, we're going to increase our working hours to 18, and we're going to try and get this built before the next big thing. Um... How soon until my children are grown up? Where are they at? 47 and 4%. Not great. Um, we have zero bonuses to speed. So working speed. How do we get bonuses? Is it just their well-being? Plus 10%. Well-being, 5. Okay. So as we get this build, I suppose, that'll be the next priority after the dam. Survival and then comfort. Survival and then comfort. Remember that, beavers. Survival and then comfort. The faster you work now, the more comfortable you'll be. Uh, we just had another beaver born, actually. So now we have... There we go. Where you at? Oh, look at you. You're so tiny. Look at it. Oh, it looks angry. Look at it, though. There needs to be beaver plushies for this game. That is something that does need to exist. We have one more day until the drought. We're not going to build this in time. Wait, they're just now bringing resources in. 
We're not making that deadline. That's fine, though. Um, they still haven't even gathered these resources, so I guess if I marked those as high, maybe they'll come... Yeah, because they can just grab those logs and take them straight to the... Are they taking them here? No, they're taking it to the wood pile. Okay. Well, we still are producing planks, I guess. How's the plank storage looking? Eh, it looks like a lumber yard, that's for sure. <laughs> Don't know what I expected from that. Um, yeah. These are still high priority, high priority, high priority, high priority. Uh, are we ever going to get this built? Oh, it's not that much. Come on, guys. We need more logs. Well, that one's built. Yeah, we're not getting that built. Not in time. Oh, how long is this drought going to be? Oh, it's so quick. The game moves so much faster. Oh, how, how long is the drought? Six days. Okay, we did a six-day drought already. We've, we've done that. This should be done in six days, too. We can do six days. We can do six days. However, if you want to see us do longer than six days, you're going to have to stand and wait for the next episode. Because this is all the time we have for today. If you want to see if our new beavers can survive up to 30-day droughts, subscribe down below. And we'll see you next time. Bye, guys.